Hey everybody, how we doing? Back at it again with another video. Um, this time, this is going to be a continuation of the uh, kind of Toretto IP address and other uh, issues that people have brought up to me with their uh, connections and just to see if I can probably solve some of those problems. Anyways, let's jump right into it. So, I know the routine. We're going to end up going to our settings and we're going to go to our network settings. And from there, it'll give you your network status, IP address, my NAP type is open, all services available, everything's all good to go there. For some people, it may still say NAT type is strict. You may have slower uh, upload speeds, download speeds, um, packet percentage is lost. So you can go ahead and do your own test here, test network speed and statistics. But um, mine is pretty decent. So we're going to hop right into advanced settings. Let me uh, not expose some of my information like I said last time. Anyways. So, uh, we're going to go to DNS settings this time. And please note, if you haven't seen the first video, then uh, please watch that before you hop on this. This is going to be like more of a uh, if the other stuff doesn't work. And I'll continue to put out more videos. So, DNS settings. Uh, we're going to go manual. And there's two different ways that you can do this, um, depending on where you live. And there are other videos that kind of go into more depth with this. But for those of us that live in the U.S., um, you're going to type in 8, 8, 8, 8. I know, it's kind of weird. For the first one, you can press start. Then you're going to do 8, 8, 4. Oh, backspace that. 4, 4. Then it will... Um, go ahead and test that for you so you can just back out from there in the meantime. And it's all good. Connection or your console connected to the internet. Then you can go and do your uh, speed and statistics test if you'd like to. But now, um, for the parts a little more advanced, with this one you will need a PC or a laptop or something. But. Um, it's very important that if your Xbox, if you're using the Xbox One that's wired, then you have to use the wired Ethernet cable into your laptop or PC. If your Xbox is wireless, then make sure you're using a wireless connection on the uh, laptop or PC. Mine is just going to be uh, wireless, just so I can kind of just give you an example. So first thing you're going to do is come down here to your search bar. Oh, that's, that's my RuneScape account that got banned. Anyways, uh, type in run. You're gonna go up to the app that says run. It's gonna bring up a little search bar here. Type in, I already have that typed in there. CMD, that stands for command. It's gonna bring up this weird old thing. So, from here, what you wanna type in is IP config slash all. And once you do that, hit enter. It's going to bring up a ton of stuff. Um, this is going to be basically everything that you need to compare to your actual settings. So we go into advanced settings. It's going to match the... Uh, IP address, subnet, uh, gateway, wired and wireless MAC addresses. So you can kind of compare and contrast those two. The uh, wired and wireless MAC address are going to be labeled as a physical address yeah, right there. So you can kind of copy those, uh, make sure that they're all matching each other and whatnot. And of course, that's going to be going down and hitting manual and doing it from there. And this is only in the event that for some reason, the way that I stated in my previous video where you can just go down, hit clear, and then hit restart, doesn't work. So if that doesn't work, then go and do this method, uh, type it in manually, 
And then same is going to go with your IP settings. Make sure you compare those all. Make sure that matches. And then from there, go ahead and do uh, the, just reset your Xbox. It should maintain the settings that you've already changed. If it doesn't, then you're going to have to do that again. And it should work. If it does not work, then there's a full system reset that I basically was preaching in my previous video in the comment section. Um, do that. And if for some reason it still does not work, please let me know in the comments. I will continue to address those issues and put out more videos as I can find solutions. Uh, like, comment, subscribe.